Hello, my name is Nick Klensky, reporting for the RSNA Daily Bulletin. I'm here at RSNA 2019 with Dr. Jay Sung to discuss how using a radiology nurse navigator can improve breast care. Dr. Sung, can you explain what a nurse navigator position is? Sure. Um, a nurse navigator is a person who has experience in navigating through both the clinical and the, uh, the technical aspects of the multi multidisciplinary breast uh, imaging center. Um, so her main role is to streamline uh, patient's experience between uh, getting imaging, getting proper procedures, and then uh, setting up the, the multitudes of appointments that she has between all the different providers in the, uh, the dis multidisciplinary team, including the surgeons, the oncologist, her primary care doctor, and the radiologist. What was the goal of adding a nurse navigator to the breast center in your study? So prior to uh, her position being added, we had the roles that she had were primarily taken on by an office manager who had multiple other responsibilities. And we found that patients often had a lot of confusion um, kind of navigating through uh, their care. Um, and so oftentimes we found that they were uh, getting delays in scheduling their biopsies, um, having confusion on who to call for various questions that they've had uh, that they have arise during the entire course of their care, um, dealing with insurance companies and that issue. So, um, you know, which can be a challenge even for people who've been doing this for a while, um, but to kind of put that onto the patient and have them just call some random person um, was, I, we felt uh, very difficult and, and even unfair to the patient. So we added this position to have one single point of contact who could be the initial face of our department and then who can also coordinate uh, the care that the patient receives between our department and all the other departments as well. What impact did the nurse navigator position have on patient care in your study? Sure, so the, the project that we did was a pilot study to see uh, the impact that the adding on that uh, the role has within uh, our department and and how it affects patient care and uh, overall uh, as our study has shown it decreased the time from their Im initial abnormal imaging to the time that it took to get them their biopsies it also improved uh, the amount of uh, cases that we were able to do in that same sp spirit of, um, that same um, period of time uh, and also improve patient satisfaction because there were uh, there's less confusion. They were able to have a single point of contact, have their questions answered more succinctly and uh, on time, and they were able to better navigate the, this huge maze that they have to go through once you know they do this have some abnormal imaging findings. So um, uh, overall, um, improved the time to biopsy, increased uh, case volume, and increased patient satisfaction. In what other ways does a nurse navigator position benefit a radiology department? So the, the three things that I mentioned, the uh, improving uh, time to biopsy, case volumes, and the patient satisfaction, and then the streamlining that uh, the nurse navigator allows us to have, actually allows us, the radiologist, to have more face time with the patient, um, to provide better care, talk to them a little bit more about the things that they will be facing coming up. And, uh, and I think with with the way healthcare is transitioning, uh, especially in radiology, to a more patient-centered uh, uh, care, and also the fact that you know we're trying to change our image, and the fact that you know we just don't want to be somebody sitting behind a computer screen anymore. You know, we need to be more proactive. We need to be, um, you know, have more time with the patients and have them understand that yes, we are part of their healthcare team as well. And I think this allows us more time to interact with patients and deliver that kind of care. Thank you, Dr. Sun. This has been Nick Klensky reporting for the RSNA Daily Bulletin. You can find more RSNA 2019 news at meeting.rsna.org slash daily bulletin. Follow us all year at rsna.org slash news.